Canada's under-20 men's rugby team, as well as Japan and Russia, are still in the hunt for a berth into the Junior World Rugby Trophy final, ahead of Wednesday's fixtures. Canada will be looking to rebound from a narrow 17-15 loss to Russia, and will need to get past pool leaders Japan to keep their trophy hopes alive. For Canadian winger Curtis Appledorn, his team left it too late against Russia, but says the final quarter showed just how dangerous his side can be in this tournament. We definitely showed how, what kind of team that we can be out on the field in the last 15 minutes of that game, and I think that if we bring that into the game against Japan, we'll be fine. And um, yeah, we have a lot of great individual athletes on the team, and that, that's just what we need to bring the whole, whole 80 minutes on the field. The Canadians will be up against one of the fastest teams in the tournament on Wednesday. But forward Brett Bukaboom says although his squad lost some key players against Russia, his team will match the pace Japan brings to the table, and that Canada will have an edge in their attacking style of play. For Japan's pace, I think we just need to focus on using our forwards, getting a quick ball, and putting them on the back foot, and making them turn around, getting them tired, and using our speed out wide, because we, I think we, we have just as fast backs as they do. Canada's final match of the round robin is scheduled for a 6 p.m. kickoff at Slava Stadium in Moscow.